everyone, this is Keith Rainville, the Fat Yankee here, my friends. So we are going to make a very, very different uh, beef jerky today, okay? So I, I don't know if uh, many of you know, um, I, I'm an entrepreneur, I own many businesses. Um, that's all I've done for the past uh, 30 years, uh, been in business for myself. Um, so uh, about three years ago, uh, my wife and I, we sold the businesses we owned. We had about 70 employees, blah, blah, blah. I'm not going to get into that. But uh, we sold those businesses, and that's how I really got into the beef jerky business. So we uh, own some businesses now, and one of them is uh, the CBDstore.com. So that's CBDSstore.com. So what we do is we sell CBD products. So today, my friends, I am going to bring that business into this business and show you how to make a CBD coffee-infused beef jerky, guys. So this is a fantastic recipe. My wife and I, we brew a pot of CBD coffee every morning. It's very calming uh, and relaxing, uh, and it, it gets our day going anyway. So this is a, a coffee, a CBD-infused coffee beef jerky with an amazing flavor. Okay, so it's something very different, guys. Um, now, if you don't have CBD coffee, no problem. Just use a regular ground coffee, and if you don't have a grinder and you buy the beans, just take it and put it in your food processor, guys. It'll, it'll uh, grind those beans up in about 10 seconds or so. It's very quick to do, okay? So listen, we're gonna start off with our Black Angus beef, guys. Two pounds of Black Angus beef, and we've got our ingredients here. So I'm gonna go over the ingredients. We're gonna use some uh, kick and soy sauce. We're gonna use some black pepper. We're gonna use some Worcestershire sauce. We're gonna use our granulated garlic, okay? I'm gonna use a half a cup of Joe, baby. And uh, we're gonna use some ground coffee, and we're gonna use some, some rice wine vinegar, okay? And I'll tell you a little bit why we're gonna use rice wine vinegar later, okay? So let's get started, guys. Let's get all the kids in the pool. Let's get this CBD infused beef jerky uh, going here. And let's start off with our kick em in soy sauce. We're gonna use a half a cup, guys, of kick em in soy sauce in this recipe. Let me get this out of your way so you can see my, my pretty smiling face here. So one half a cup, my friends, of kick em in soy sauce. The kids are starting to get in the pool here. That's one half a cup. We're gonna use one tablespoon of black pepper. All right. Not a heaping tablespoon, just a little bit for flavor, okay? All right. So we got our, uh, our black pepper and our soy sauce in here. Now we're gonna use a half a cup of Worcestershire sauce, okay? So give it a little bit more salt in here and give it some Worcestershire flavor in the background of that coffee. Boy, does it really mix well. So one half a cup of Worcestershire sauce. All right. And now what we're gonna use is a, a tablespoon of granulated garlic, okay? So we're gonna use one tablespoon here. Let me just rinse this off. One tablespoon of granulated garlic. Garlic, garlic, you can never have too much garlic. Oh my God, I love it. All right, there we go. And now we're gonna to get to the coffee part, okay? So, this is brewed coffee. You wanna get it to room temperature. Um, and again, so this is a uh, coffee, and it's been, and it's been percolated, and it, it, uh, it has water in it, okay? So that's why I'm gonna use the rice wine vinegar. Okay, so I can actually bring this up to a boil and I won't have to use the rice wine vinegar. But I didn't do that. I'm going to infuse this with some fresh brewed coffee, one half a cup, okay? And now I'm going to put some ground coffee in there. This is our CBD infused coffee, okay? So I'm going to use just one third a cup of this CBD infused coffee. All right, it's going to give that nice flavor. All right, one third of a cup and I'm going to spread that around. Get that nice coffee flavor in there. Again, guys, if you do not have CBD infused coffee, uh, you can use any ground coffee, any ground bean, gives it a nice, strong, rich flavor. Or you can go to the cbdsstore.com and get some nice CBD coffee from us. It's absolutely delicious. So we got just about all the kids in the pool, guys. Look at those beautiful colors in there. And now we're gonna add our rice wine vinegar to this, okay? So here we go rice wine vinegar let me just clean off my tablespoon okay we're gonna add two tablespoons 
a rice wine vinegar. Oh, there's one. Now, let me do a half on this one because I spilled a little bit. Two tablespoons of rice wine vinegar. Okay, so this is going to kill any of those microbes that are in the water. It's very important when you're adding water to a recipe that you either boil it or you add vinegar to kill the microbes because everybody's water in the country is a little bit different. Ours in Florida here happens to have a little bit of lime because of the aquaphor. So this is it my friends, CBD infused coffee. This is a nice, rich, delicious, milky coffee flavor in this particular blend here. This is a medium roast coffee that we're using. So I'm gonna mix this around. Now you're probably saying to yourself, well what about, what about the, uh, the coffee grinds? Uh, can I eat coffee grinds? You absolutely can. Um, coffee grinds are not bad for you at all. Uh, as a matter of fact, you're gonna have some light coffee grinds on this jerky when you're, when you're absolutely, uh, when you're done. When you're done dehydrating this, you're gonna have some light coffee grinds on it, which is actually gonna give it a nice light flavor, okay? Oh, look at this. Now, you can, you can obviously get a nice clean uh, basting brush and baste off the coffee after you're done, but I actually like to leave it on there because it really does give it a nice, rich flavor, okay? So here we go. This is our CBD infused coffee, all mixed up. Let me show you what that looks like. All right, here we go. Oh, I wish this was Smell-O-Vision. It is absolutely fantastic. Guys, this is delicious. You gotta try this recipe. CBD infused coffee from the cbdsstore.com. Guys, check us out. I'll leave the link below. Uh, and uh, we help a lot of people over there with chronic pain. So guys, this is the Fat Yankee. Hope you liked the video. Hope you tried this recipe. Uh, and I hope you subscribe to the channel, my friends. Hey, thanks again for watching. We'll see you soon.